Welcome back to another episode of the vlog. It is the day before our travel to Mackay. If you're new here, please make sure you do subscribe. I really do appreciate all your support here on the YouTube vlog channel. So it's the day before we leave to head to Mackay for our first trial. We've got the Broncos this weekend on Saturday night. Now I've just pulled the bag out. It's time to get packing and ready to go to Mackay tomorrow. And then after Mackay, we're actually heading to Ellie Beach for a little pre-season camp before round one so I'm gonna get stuck into some packing basically I've got to put my clothes all of these clothes into there so get in there so that's it got all casual clothes here undies all my training kit there casual shoes that's my roller and stretcher toiletries just got to get my boots tomorrow then obviously got my backpack as well which needs to be filled with a few hats and sunglasses so it doesn't usually take me that long to pack i've got it kind of down pat with everything i usually pack on a regular basis but now it's time for me to go and chill out with a wifey because spending some time apart over the next few days so spend the last night together and we're going to go and watch something on TV and catch up with you guys in the morning. Good morning fam. Today is the day of travel so not long gotten up. It is still quite early, quarter to six now. Just better get picked up and head into the ground to get a COVID test and then get on the bus and head to the airport for our trip to Mackay where we will train this afternoon and then play tomorrow night. So let's go. Just not long gotten home from Captain's Run and recovery. So tonight we've got our usual team dinner and then massage this evening for game day tomorrow. So I've just had a shower. It's all my stuff there on the bed. I'm actually sitting here watching the Manly vs. Canberra game on TV. Man, it's so good to just sit back and watch some footy back now. My roomie, Brendan Elliott, new to the club. He's actually still out at the moment, so wait for him to get back and then we're gonna go and get a feed. So um, yeah, just quickly checking in and first time putting on the colors tomorrow. So it's gonna be an exciting day. We'll see you then. Okay, so there is some of this vlog missing. So basically after I recorded the last clip, I completely forgot to film any more clips after that. So that night in Mackay, we obviously had dinner the night before the game and then the following night we had our first trial against the Broncos which was played in extremely tough conditions so the field probably didn't look very boggy on TV but it was very heavy there was water logged all through the field so it was pretty tough conditions obviously the footy was very wet as well uh, the game we obviously came away with a good win boys played really really well and then after that I also forgot to film we went to Airlie Beach the next day so we arrived for our pre-season team camp for a few days to do some training and also just to hang out and get ready for a big season ahead. So our apartment in Ellie Beach was really, really nice. Again, I was rooming with Brendan and our place had an incredible view up on the hill. It had a two bedroom apartment as well with its own kitchen. It looked awesome. So we had a few days in Ellie Beach and then after that, it was time to pack up and head to Sydney for the season launch and also spend the last week weekend in Sydney with some family and friends. So we'll pick up there. It is our last day here in Ellie Beach. So we came here straight after our trial for training camp with the team. Been a really good few days and now's the last day today before we head home. So the team's actually heading back up to Townsville and I'm actually flying out of Ellie Beach back to Sydney. So meeting the family down there this afternoon as it is the last weekend off before round one starts. And also, I am attending the NRL season launch tomorrow. But first, I've quickly just got to pack up 
pack up my stuff and then got to go down and get a COVID test. But let's start packing. Just rocked up here to Whit Sunday's airport, and my family's flying from Townsville back to Sydney today, so I'm meeting them there. The last few days, we've been in Ellie Beach on team camp after our trial in Mackay against the Broncos. It's been a great few days, and now I'm just about to. I'm actually at the airport really early, so I've got a lot of time to kill. Bag, so let's go. Just landed in Sydney Airport. Take my mask off. Picking up the hire car right now. And not gonna lie, I'm a bit frustrated at the moment. So, just got into the hire car. And so today is Wednesday and it's 10 to 6 right now. And like I said, a little bit frustrated right now because, so I'll go back a little bit. So on Saturday we played in Mackay against the Broncos and we left for Mackay on Friday. And we went to Mackay, play the game, had a really good result. Then on Sunday, we went to Airlie Beach for our preseason camp for a few days. And so since Sunday till today, I've been in Airlie. And tomorrow, I'm heading to the NRL season launch, which is why I've come down to Sydney. And obviously, this weekend is the last weekend off before round one. And I thought, I'm coming to Sydney for the season launch. I may as well bring the family down as well for the weekend. And today, the family was supposed to fly into Sydney today and meet me here and I was literally supposed to land like half an hour before them. Before I got on the flight, Marissa was telling me that the taxi was running late and they ended up missing their flight. So I'm pretty, I don't know, I don't want to say too many words right now, but I'm pretty upset to be honest. I haven't seen the kids for just under a week and they're supposed to be here now because we booked a maxi taxi with car seats and it ran late and forced them to miss their flight. So yeah, I'm extremely frustrated. It sucks and Marissa's been really upset. She had to go back home, stress of bringing three kids to, or taking three kids to the airport, missing the flight and then having to go back home. Now she's rebooked on tomorrow's on a flight tomorrow. So I'm gonna head to the accommodation now and then, yeah, wait for them. Then I'll pick them up from the airport tomorrow. So a bit frustrated, but I'm absolutely starving. So gonna head to the accommodation. Just pulled up to the Airbnb and I am starving. I'm also very dehydrated. I need to get some water and some dinner. And I don't even know what I'm gonna do for dinner tonight because I'm by myself. So let's go and suss this Airbnb. Gotta get this code. All right, I'm in. Have a go at this place, man. Water right there. It looks beautiful. All right, I'm in. This place is cool. My wife even getting packages delivered here. Jeez, I got this lounge room and this view. Weather's not too great in Sydney. And the pool, the back fridge. Oh, oh my goodness. There's a product in the back fridge. <laughs> oh my goodness. So we'll go for a quick walk around. Man, that's another kitchen. So many bedrooms. Have a go at that. Look, the kids' room's all set up. 
Fire pit, kids toys, kids rooms. Here's the kitchen. I feel like I haven't even shown you guys everything yet. Wow, this place is awesome, man. So good for kids too. So I'm just about to have something to eat, have some dinner, and then I am going to have a shower and freshen up, and then I'll catch up with you guys tomorrow because we're heading to the NRL season launch. Yo, good morning. Had a nice little sleep in today. It is 7.30 New South Wales time, which is really 6.30 Queensland time, which that is time I'm on at the moment. And I've just got some training to do this morning. So the boys back in North Queensland, they're training today. So I am going to do a field session, then I'm gonna to go to the gym. The weather in Sydney still overcast and raining. Best about this the whole time we're here. So I'm gonna go and do some training and then I'll catch you after. Okay, just got back from a running session this morning. A few Ks in the bank of some conditioning. And you would know that I had a pretty decent rant about the family and the one three cabs. Not picking them up in time so they missed their flight. So here is a quick update uh, on the family. As you know, they were delayed by a day. So they're supposed to get on a flight this morning. Marissa rings me this morning and says their flight from Brisbane to Sydney is canceled because they weren't on a direct flight. They were flying from Townsville to Brisbane and then Brisbane to Sydney. That flight's now been canceled. But as I'm recording live right now, another flight has been sorted. So they're due to arrive at 2.45 p.m. this afternoon. But I'm starving, so it's time for breakfast. All right, so break is done. Now I'm gonna head to the gym, then launch. All right, <clears throat> just got home from the gym and got dressed, got my kit ready. Now I'm about to head into my car. I'm actually getting picked up by a car and getting taken into the Telstra building for the NRL season launch with a member from every team. Okay, that is it for today's vlog. Guys, really hope you enjoyed this vlog. Please make sure you stay tuned to the channel for some more episodes throughout the season. This will be the last vlog before kickoff. So looking forward to what's gonna be a fantastic year. Can't wait to get stuck in. And this afternoon, we're just about to jump into my daughter Mia's first birthday. So have a go at this. Got the jumping castle in the backyard. Pool's ready to go with a view. So if you enjoyed these vlogs, please make sure you do subscribe. Here is some extra footage of me over the past few weeks doing a few promos and whatnot. And as always, see you guys on the next episode. There you go, I'm <laughs> here. <laughs>